I'm supposed to be doing this stuff. You know that, right? Okay, fine. Fine. Fine, Josie Wales. Fine. It's a high one. It's a high one. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she knows high. She knows, uh, oh, it's a roller. <laughs> she knows them all. She's smarter than the average bear. That's right. She's smarter than the average bear. Somebody's got to do this work. It ain't gonna happen all by itself. This heavy breather quits breathing on me so much. Just take it easy, Osher. <laughs> At the mast build, I got this dude marked here 12 inches off the ground. And the reason for that is, is I'm gonna put a winch on here. I'm gonna drill and tap the holes here and bolt that dog right on there. And then, uh, then we'll run the cable up to a pulley and then, of course, over to the mast to pull, pull that dude back up. Yeah, I tested this thing. It's sitting out in the yard, and of course on the quad for, I don't know, six, maybe seven years or something. <laughs> and it works perfect. It still works good. That's fantastic. Basically marked this. I marked that one hole. And like that, doesn't need to be perfect yet. So once we do that one, then we'll mark this top one and drill and tap it. bolting this guy up here to uh, get it on there before we get too far along here. Don't want to whale on too hard. Let me break these things. I gotta get better bolts. I will. But this should be pretty tough. Uh -huh. Okay. It's all hunky dory. Folks, I got some fairly big bolts here. They're about an extra, I guess, about 10 millimeters longer. 10 turns. Yeah, once it got in the thread, 10 turns. That's that's pretty sweet. Big heavy duty bolt like that is very important. Yeah, that's what we're going with. Yeah, that's what we're going with. It's a big heavy duty bolt. I'll take this here guy. Put a drip or two of oil on things here. I know for sure if I go out here, we can test it a little bit. Yes, we can. <laughs> we don't drop it and break the whole thing. It's like, oh, you gotta stand back here for a second. Stand back here, come on, straighten up, straighten up. There you go. how tough these guys are up here right because uh i just got two of those uh unistrut that's what it's called unistrut <laughs> but uh you know i got three up there i can actually put three and i can run bolts through them to hold them all together i know 
this is not the probably the UL approved method. <laughs> but I uh, yeah, I just gave it a, a full, you know, a double wrap. And then I used this uh, stainless steel uh, clamp to uh, hold it there. It holds itself, you know, just by attention, but you need something, right? Now I rigged this dude up here a little bit here. I moved the, uh, the pulley over to the left one notch. And uh, you see, I got that support on the bottom and I got one on the top, <clears throat> just like that. I got all three of those dudes bolted together and uh that'll be way plenty because i was doing it with just one before and it would it would do okay <laughs> so let's put a little beef on it let's get back a little bit <laughs> let's stand back everybody stand back okay let's see oh yeah i didn't even hardly flinch those things Check again here. So let's set down. All right, see, so you can see it beefing a little bit on that uh, pipe, especially. I don't know if that's the correct uh, height for the uh, clamping of the. The wire it might be too low or too high i don't know i just roughly guessed it it's way way too low it's about two feet too low which is good because uh i'm gonna move it up and give it a lot more leverage and not uh require so much power <laughs> uh -huh. Tom Brown, man. Cool. <laughs> All right, let me adjust this dude up here. I'm gonna put it up about right about there. I think that'll be real close. Stand back here a bit. All right. We got power. Yeah. It should be quite a bit easier. Just a couple feet will make a huge difference. Justin, come here. Come here. Okay, Joe, so hang on. Yeah, I know we just sit underneath that thing when you're testing it for basically the first time. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I might have to go out just a smidge on those guys, but uh, not so bad all in all, I have to say. Yeah, that is good. Holy smoke! Yeah. Oh yeah, look at that. That's pretty sweet, baby. Holy smoke! Yeah, it's got to go back, like I was saying, this way. But not much, man. I mean, not much. Move all three of those rails this way towards us, about maybe a half inch. Anyway, what I'll do is I'll loosen them up and tap them over a bit, you know, while it's bound up, and then uh, we can. Uh, see what uh, angle we got as we're playing with it. It's pretty awesome though. Makes me dizzy when I look up there like I'm looking up at a skyscraper. Get back here we can take an eyeball and run it better. Now a six foot turbine on top of that dude, right? Yeah, okay cool. Looks pretty good, huh? <laughs> I'm pretty impressed myself. I'm impressed.
You guys should be able to see that, right? It's easier to see, maybe. Oh yeah, I can see that good. Okay. Yeah. Pretty straight. Check this one here. Yeah, stinking, stinking straight. Pretty good. Okay, all right, here we have it. Turn on into that brand new frizz. That brand new frizz, mom, just got you. There you go. Look at that thing fly like an expert flyer. Yeah, way better than those. What are you doing over there? Come on, you're on camera. <laughs> uh huh. Okay, take a look at this dude at long range here. Yeah, okay. Pretty stinking good. That dude way up there, isn't it? <laughs> uh-huh. I should have good wind up there. See that tree over there blowing, right? Yeah. All my trees here. I might have to cut those ones down, the neighbors got. <laughs> and here comes some ducks in for a meal. You wanna go get those ducks? <laughs> okay, fine. Oh, that's a good one. Look at that chiquita. That thing flies like a dream. Yeah, it looks pretty dang big. <laughs> it looks big. Yeah, so that should be pretty sweet looking. <laughs> uh -huh. Yeah, okay, you can see it's placing straight with the other poles for the uh, for the array, for the solar array. Yeah. Not bad. Not bad for old hillbilly. Oh hillbilly boy. There you go. Oh, it's a good one there, Josh. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Oh, she's got it. Oh, this one's good. Look at that. Now that I uh, straightened it up a little bit up there. It's not nearly as bound up as it was. Which is good. Okay, well. I run wires through there. I gotta drill a hole. Yeah, I'm gonna drill a hole right there on the side, I think. That might be the best spot. Because then the wires come out here, right? And go out the hole. And then I have uh, some conduit or something to get it up on over there. Uh -huh. Okay, anyway. Yeah. <laughs> uh -huh. So if it's blowing hard, it might do that or something. That's why we need those guy wires up there. <laughs> Go right down here. In here somewhere. Yeah, I'm thinking here and not doing anything, so I better let you go. I better let you go. Peace, baby. I love you, man. <laughs>